large uh, aircraft scales. Despite being the president of a company that manufactures large scales, Harold Thomas has never measured the weight of the world. Okay. Just the rocket bound for another world. Artemis is going to be a major part of history. General Electrodynamics in Arlington is part of the team taking America back to the moon. The Artemis One mission is scheduled to launch today, the United States' first trip to the moon in 50 years. And this is one of 10 platforms that we sold to NASA. GEC's scales, each capable of weighing up to 80,000 pounds, were used by NASA to weigh its new moon rocket, the SLS. They're going around the moon. And without SeaTech, a company in North Richland Hills, the entire mission would fall apart. 100%. Literally. Oh, super exciting. This aerospace hardware distributor provided the nuts and bolts that hold together the Orion capsule, where on future missions, astronauts will ride. Clearly, without SeaTech, this doesn't happen. Altogether, at least 34 North Texas companies had a hand in getting us back to the moon. Although NASA says the moon is only a pit stop. Our sights are not set on the moon. Our sights are set clearly on Mars. Which is a full circle moment for GEC. That's right. When NASA first went to Mars in 1964, GEC built the cameras that gave us the first pictures ever of the red planet. And now dozens of other North Texas companies are taking us further. We contributed to that. It's just rewarding to, to play a real small part and role in, in that process. One of many small steps toward the next big leap. In Arlington, I'm Sean Giggy.